congratulations to the 10th year anniversary of uh, Mekong Challenge. I am the second batch of the Mekong Challenge business competition in 2007. My business idea at the time is a uh, toys and me toy retail store. And uh, I come up to the Mekong Challenge at the time because uh, before that I joined the reading seminar. My book that I joined at the time is uh, Good to Great. And then we know that we have the business plan competition and I join as a mid application and finally my idea have been uh, selected one among the 20 idea at a time. And then I have been joined the whole process of the business plan so we know how to, to set up the, the business in a structure way. So finally we have implemented that and now uh, Toys and Me have been three branch now in Cambodia, one in the um, uh, Eon Mall and the other two is a, a standalone outlet. We have around 60 staff in, in uh, Toys and Me currently and it's still uh, operated. And in 2011, I have been moved out from Toys and Me as from the general manager of Toys and Me to start another business. We, I have uh, started up a big solution at the early of 2011 and I have started uh, Gear as a LG distributor in July 2011 at the same year and now G Gear uh, uh, we have around 282 staff. In 2014 since I'm very active participant in the Young Entrepreneur Association 2014 all our senior people and uh, 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 business community they elect me to be the president of Young Entrepreneur Association so I have uh, lead the Young Entrepreneur Association since 2014 up to now so this year is my second term as the president for the 2016 and 17, and it also my last term as well. Mm -hmm. So, not only the business uh, point of view, we have I I am very uh, uh, impressed uh, with the Mekong Challenge up to 10 year journey. If we compare the Mekong Challenge in the early stage and now, you can see a lot of impact. Not only the Mekong Challenge itself, but a lot of startup platform, a lot of co working space, a lot of uh, uh, advocate a lot of voice of young entrepreneurs to the government. It, it's a lot of things happen. I wish the Mekong Challenge going to be a success and continue their endeavor in Cambodia and promote the entrepreneurship in Cambodia more and uh, promote more to the youth to become the entrepreneur. Thank you. Congratulations to the 10th anniversary of Mekong Challenge. I did an internship uh, with McKenzie and Company in 2008 and after that I joined Mekong Challenge in 2009. I am also a member of the book club that was run by Steve. Um, right now I'm running my own business. It's an event management company. We do corporate events such as staff party, product launching, concert, exhibition and fashion shows. Lastly, I wish Mekong Challenge more successful in the year ahead and thank you very much still for all the connections, all the hard work that you have brought so far to us. Thank you. Good afternoon everyone. Uh, happy 10th anniversary for the Mekong Challenge program. Uh, my name is Bun Liang, people in the first part of the program. And uh, I'm uh, very happy that the program has been uh, in operating for, for 10 years. Uh, thanks to Steve and Mackenzie uh, and company who has been helping out uh, and uh, has been pushing for a uh, uh, better program, better competition. Uh, since day one, only Cambodia is part of the, the, the business competition. Now there are uh, seven countries, uh, including Bhutan is part of it. Uh, so definitely there are a lot of uh, entrepreneurs has been uh, learning from the program. And aside from that, the, the reading book program, which I am a part of, as I remember, uh, that was 10 years ago, Family Fly, uh, the first book on globalization also, uh, also gave me a lot of idea on how to actually understand the, uh, the business scene back then and how the business kind of changed through time. It has been one decade. So uh, I hope the program can run for another 10 years or even further and uh, I wish uh, the program all the best. Thank you. Congratulations to the 10 years anniversary of Mekong Business Challenge. And um, my name is Moni Pek Su. Um, currently, I'm the general manager of 
Emerald Plus Property Management Services. I was born in was born and raised in Cambodia, but um, luckily I've got a chance to travel to more than 20 countries in the world. And um, as I remember back in my school, uh, back to five six years ago, uh, I've got a chance to be um, to be shortlisted of the top two Cambodian business Mekong challenge competitions um, to against with the other three countries Vietnam, Thailand and, uh, uh, and Laos and also um, during my university as well I've been participating a lot in the social activity especially with the book club um, with Stephen Patterson um, at that time I remember we were talking about the globalization and we were focusing on uh, the top company of Apple, Google etc. And we've been sharing a lot of knowledge and uh, we've been raising up so many questions in order to challenge uh, ourselves. And um, luckily we've got uh, a chance to uh, have a short stay at um, Howard Business School as well as the MIT. And also because of uh, from the young Cambodian um, entrepreneurs, somehow we uh, we try to activate ourselves, we try to get a chance to travel and also to get to know the other countries and get to know the, the other people from the other entity as well. And just now I switched into the property management because in Cambodia there's a lot of property are going up and um, we are aiming to provide the standard services to the other building owners and also, as well as the services in Cambodia is quite new. Um, if we compare to the other country like Singapore and Hong Kong, that's why. And uh, how was my team decide to create the property management company here in Cambodia? And um, congratulations to all of the shortlist team. Uh, and I can't wait to see the winner for tonight. Um, they are so special because this year there are seven countries to participate. And all of the best to you and um, I hope to see all of the team one day and um, good luck. Happy 10th anniversary Mekong Challenge. This is Kalyan. I was in the first batch of the program in 2006. Later on, I went to pursue my master's degree in the United States through the Fulbright program. Upon my graduation, I was accepted for an internship with Dar in Singapore through Mr. Joachim Ackerman, who was then the Vice President in the Strategic Planning Department. Currently, I'm working as a Policy Specialist for the United Nations Development Program in New York City. Thank you so much for the experience, and I wish to many more years of anniversaries from the Mekong Challenge. Happy 10th anniversary again. Thank you.